This is Azores Today with Yuri Shatarevsky, your number one English news broadcast for the Azores Island and Portugal. Welcome everyone, I am Uri Czartoryevsky and this is another edition of Azores Today for the week of April 16th, 2012. We start with the health unit of Piku Island. They will soon have a reserve of blood to cope with emergency situations. The Azorian government has given them the proper funds so they can purchase new equipment for blood transfusions for all three health centers of Piku Island. Now, the process is that the blood collected will be sent to the hospital of Orta, then be treated, and then returned to the existing reserves in Piku. The Azorian government also authorized the acquisition of various medical equipment designed to further equip and renovate all three health centers in Piku Island. One of these machines are to help the treatment used for people experiencing life-threatening cardiac problems where the heart is shocked to encourage normal rhythm to return. This machine alone is valued at 20,000 euros. In other news, it is good to be a fisherman or better yet, a fishing company. The amount of fish catched in Piku in the months of January and February has already surpassed last year's numbers. Now the increase was an average of 10,000 pounds per month more than last year. And Piku Island is not alone. All throughout the Azores, the fishing industry has been excited with record catches for all areas around the Nine Islands. In related news, a new strike is underway for workers from the islands of Fael, Piku, San George, Flores and Corvo have organized a five-day strike in protest against discrimination in the workplace, which they claim to be victims. The strike will take place between 23rd and 27th of April. This was announced by the Union of Civil Servants from the Azores. The issue, according to the union leader, is the difference that exists between those five docks and the other islands in the matter of working hours and its schedule. The strike can cripple the loading and uploading of goods in the commercial ports of the five islands. Also, the landing passengers from two cruise ships that are expected in the port of Orta will be affected and the movement of various yachts in all marinas will suffer. From out of the strike are the busiest ports in the region, including Punta Delgada. And finally, a story that also deals with discrimination and pride. The gay and lesbian communities in the Azores are playing their first gay pride this year in the islands, and Alexandra Boga, a Pico resident and artist, is heading the campaign. Here's a report on the presentation of this idea in Toronto. Oh, 
like, first of all, to say that I'm very glad to be here. Uh, not only because uh, I share with you the interest of promoting Portuguese in Canada, uh, which has been quite well done, I think, in the last few days by the team that has accompanied Terry Costa. Not only possible, it is happening. Pride Azores is the first ever LGBT organization in the Azores Islands in Portugal. Sometimes people don't really understand why I fight for human rights. I realize that we should have the same rights and the liberty to be who we are and what we want to be in everywhere in the world. I'm honored to be speaking to you on behalf of the board and staff of Pride Toronto as we announce this new solidarity partnership with Pride Resorts. This partnership is a great fit for both our organizations and a wonderful way to bring both of our communities together. Pride Toronto is proud to support Pride Azores as our solidarity partner and in turn to have their support as well. I'd like to thank Alexandra and Terry for bringing this great idea to us. Thank you. This concludes the first section of this program of Acers Today. Coming up, your Azorian and Portuguese sports. Welcome to Acers Today Sports. On this special edition, we would like to feature a video with Cristiano Ronaldo's 2012 campaign. Enjoy! Nossa, nossa, assim você me mata Ai, se eu te pego, ai, ai, se eu te pego Delícia, delícia, assim você me mata Ai, se eu te pego, ai, ai, se eu te pego, hein Na balada A galera começou a dançar E passou a menina mais linda Tomei coragem e comecei a falar Sábado na balada A galera começou a dançar E passou a menina mais linda Tomei coragem e comecei a falar nossa, nossa, assim você me mata Ai, se eu te pego, ai, ai, se eu te pego Delícia, delícia, assim você me mata Ai, se eu te pego, ai, ai, se eu te pego Na balada A galera começou a dançar E passou a menina mais linda Tomei coragem e comecei a falar Sábado na balada A galera começou a dançar E passou a menina mais linda Tomei coragem e comecei a falar nossa, nossa, assim você me mata Ai, se eu te pego, ai, ai, se eu te pego Delícia, delícia, assim você me mata Ai, se eu te pego, ai, ai, se eu te pego Nossa, nossa, assim você me mata Ai, se eu te pego, ai, ai, se eu te pego Delícia, delícia, assim você me mata Ai, se eu te pego, ai, ai, se eu te pego, hein Sábado na balada A galera começou a dançar E passou a menina mais linda Tomei coragem e comecei a falar Sábado na balada A galera começou a dançar E passou a menina mais linda Tomei coragem e comecei a falar Nossa, nossa, assim você me mata Ai, se eu te pego, ai, ai, se eu te pego Delícia, delícia, assim você me mata Ai, se eu te pego, ai, ai, se eu te pego
This is Azores Today with Yuri Shatarevsky, your number one English news broadcast for the Azores Island and Portugal.